Hello everybody, it's Mike here at the uh, Humble Bundle Home Shopping Network, or I mean Game From Scratch. Now I gotta admit, it feels like I'm doing a lot of these Humble Bundle videos just because, well Humble Bundle just keeps putting out great stuff. And today is no exception. If you are looking for game development books, this one is kind of the mother load. It is a great bargain, and without further ado, let's jump right in. Now, if you're not aware of it, Humble Bundle is a resource, kind of like an online store. More and more, it's becoming my new Steam, if I'm honest. But basically, they put together bundles of stuff. Uh, mostly software, but also they're getting more and more into books, comic books, that kind of stuff. Uh, and you can allocate your money between the people who created the stuff, between charity, and between Humble Bundle. And generally, you pay for different tiers, and as you hire a tier up, you unlock more and more things. And today, the bundle is all about game development books created by Pact Publishing. Now, Pact is a mixed bag. Um, they allow just about anyone to write for them, including myself. I've actually written a book for and published by Pact. And so the quality of their works is very random. It all kind of comes down to how good the author is that they picked. But they really do go for subject matter experts to write about a very niche field. And there's a whole lot of niche fields when it comes to game development. And this bundle is loaded with books. Now, a lot of times you look at these bundles and go, all right, it's going to be crap. It's going to be two versions out of date and so on. But in this case, no, absolutely not. This bundle is current. So here's what you get. So basically, if you pay a buck, you get these books. And I'll show you what formats you get and that kind of stuff in just a second. And of course, I will toss the link down below, so don't worry about that kind of stuff. But at the $1 tier, you get creating a game using the Blender Game Engine, which I admit, with Blender Game Engine being deprecated, may have a limited shelf life. But there's also UPBGE, which should still keep this relevant. Mastering SFML game development. Game Physics Cookbook, Basics of Coding with Unreal Engine 4, and Beginning C++ Game Programming. So if you pay a buck, you get those five books. If you jump up a tier to $8, you get all of those five books, plus Practical Game AI Programming, Modern C++ 3D Game Tutorial Series and 3D Rendering, Mastering Unreal 4.x Game Development, Virtual Reality Blueprints, Building a Character Using Blender 3D, uh, Unity 2017 Mobile Game Development, Unity 2017 Game Optimization, Practical Game Design, and Learning C Sharp by Developing Games with Unity 2017, which coincidentally I think is a very bad idea, but to each of their own. And then if you jump up to the $15 tier, you get Vulcan Cookbook, which I know a lot of people are going to be excited about, which is kind of funny because I got to imagine in the space of a book, that probably covers how to draw a triangle on screen, and then they ran out of pages. But anyways, also you get the Godot, Godot Engine Game Development Projects book. This was literally just published like six months ago and cost more than $15. So for the price of one book on Godot, you get all of these other books for free, and you still save money on that one book. Kind of makes this one a no-brainer if any of the titles there pop out at you. Um, next up, we got Swift 3 Game Development, Mastering Unity 2017 Game Development with C Sharp. Getting started with Unity 2018, so we're obviously quite current on this one. Unity 2017 Game AI Programming, Unity 2017 2D Game Development, Unity Virtual Reality Projects, Learning C++ by Creating Games with Unreal Engine. Coincidentally, when I said learning C Sharp using Unity was a very bad idea, learning C++ <laughs> is even worse, but add to each their own. And then um, Game pattern Development Patterns and Best Practices. I was unaware of this one. I'm actually pretty excited. I've always been using that free online book that's out there. Uh, it's a subject I'm definitely interested in, and I think a lot of you are as well, judged by some of my uh, game pattern books or posts that I've done in the past on YouTube. And then finally, we've got Learning C Sharp by Developing Games with Unity, another edition. Again, not my number one choice. Now, one thing I should point out here is this one is a video. This one here is a video. Uh, I should have pointed that out as I went through. Okay, that's it. Oh, no, video and video. So a couple of these are videos as well. So video tutorial, this one on Blender Creation, OpenGL, and this one on Mastering uh, Unreal Engine 4 are all videos. Now, do I think you should buy this at the $15 tier or the $1 tier or $8 tier? Well, here's your answer. This is my page. I bought it. So this is what you get with this bundle. Basically, right away, you can send the ebooks off to your Kindle e-reader, which is kind of cool. So if you've got a Kindle account, you can basically push this out, and they'll all be available to your Kindle device. So if you read on an iPad or a Kindle or similar, you can just push it right out to your Kindle device. So you, this would be the exact same as if you'd bought these books on Amazon, which is quite cool. And then we get into the downloads. Now, this is all the video section, so you see the sizes vary very much. Um, so we're looking at 700 megs to 3 gigs in size. And you can, the nice thing with Humble 
is you get a portal page. You can go in and download your assets at any time. You just log into Humble and they are there for downloading. And then we get into your eBooks and each eBook is available in PDF, EPUB, and Mobi. Uh, that's pretty much all of your, your major readers kind of covered right there. At the very least, that's your Kindle and your... Oh, God, was it Kobe? I don't know. There's the the one that isn't a Kindle that like six people in the world bought. Uh, but it covers your e-book reader. This will be good for your desktop. Uh, so you can basically read these books in any format you want. And again, you can download them at as many times as you want from here. And then again, that cool thing is up here, you can push them directly out to your Kindle. Oh, that's the one I was looking for, Nook. Yeah. So I, I don't know anyone that owns a Nook if I'm honest about things. But uh, all the same, if you're a Nook owner, by no means did I mean that's an insult. I just haven't met one of you people yet. Uh, so what did you think? Is, is this kind of another no-brainer purchase? Uh, i got to say, Humble's really kind of been nailing it out of the park lately. How do you not buy uh, seven or eight videos and then seven or eight books that are all really quite current? Uh, well, more than seven or eight. We're talking about a dozen books there for 15 bucks. Again, this is kind of a no-brainer. Now, if you are interested in learning Unity, and you're going to go about it this route. <laughs> well, if you're worried about that 2017, when you look at it as 2018.3 is, as of the time of this video, the most current version, don't worry about that. What you learn with 2017 is pretty much 100% still relevant today. So none of these books on this list at all are out of date. Like everything here is still relevant. This one's going to be a bit iffy with Blender 2.8 coming along, but even still, like you're going to uh, it's still going to show you inside of Blender itself, and there's the UPBGE product keeping Blender alive. So there is a lot of really relevant and current stuff here. There is not a dud among these books. Now, again, packed quality can really run the gamut. It comes down to a lot of times the, the proofreading quality is a little, yeah, especially if they got an author that was... Um, not English as first language, because a lot of times their editors are also not English as first language, and it can slip through a bit. So you can see some shoddy quality when it comes to packed books, but other ones are absolutely great. So it's a bit of a hodgepodge, throw it up the wall, see what's stuck kind of development process. But I guarantee you, out of this list of books and videos, there is at least one on there worth 15 bucks. So as you can see from the page in front of you, this purchase is a no-brainer for me. It took me about 16 seconds to log in, add to my account, and purchase it. And I'm curious if you guys are in the same boat. Are you guys going to buy this outright? Is there a particular book on there that has you tempted? Do you own any of these books already, and are you going to recommend for or against them? Let us all know. Comments down below. I'm sure a lot of people are going to be wondering how good any of these particular titles are. Also, if you're interested in a specific one, I can do it a good skim read and let you know. Um, I own all of them now, apparently. So if there's one specifically you want to know about, perhaps I know something about it or someone reading in the comments down below will know something about it and can tell you if it is a good book or not. But I gotta say, at 15 bucks for 20 books and videos, uh, no brainer in my opinion. But what's yours? I'd love to hear it and I'll talk to you all later. Goodbye.